First, though, breaking news on a big law enforcement presence just off the beach line. Sky 6 over Dallas Boulevard in the Wedgefield area of Orange County, where you can see several patrol cars and emergency vehicles are lined up there near some woods. This is News 6 at 4. I'm Ginger Gadsden. I'm Julie Broughton. And I'm Lisa Bell. We want to get right out to News 6's Catherine Silver, who is live at the scene. And Catherine, you just learned this has to do with a home invasion in another county. Yeah, we're just getting some information as I'm speaking to you now. I'm standing along the corner of Somerset Street. It's right off of Dallas Boulevard. I want to show you what we're looking at. You can see a group of law enforcement officers gathered here. They're parked next to some vehicles, both marked and unmarked. We've been watching some groups of officers in three different areas close to here this afternoon. There's this scene here and right off in the trees just out of view is a vehicle. I want to show you a closer look at that car right now. This is some video that our crew shot within the last hour. The car has the trunk and all of the doors open. We just learned from the Osceola County Sheriff's Office that a group of armed suspects wanted after a home invasion, abandoned a car here and then ran off into the woods. The Sheriff's Office says that, the, that they were assisting the St. John's Sheriff's Office and it appears that's where all of this started this afternoon. I also want to show you some video from up above. Sky 6 was following this investigation today as multiple agencies were working on finding these suspects. The Osceola County Sheriff's Office says they now have three people in custody. Sky 6 captured what looks like some of them on the ground in handcuffs. We also watched a person that was escorted to an ambulance and of course we're asking questions to see what else we can learn. Now back here live I mentioned we've seen law enforcement in some other areas today. They're also on the next street over which is Starry and then closer to the 528 which is right down the road from here. We're going to keep asking more questions and as soon as we get more information we'll bring it to you live both on air and online. For now I'm live near Wedgefield. Catherine Silver getting results. News 6.